Hello, welcome to Trekkie World. Me ask questions of all me neighbors on Avenue Q. The sun is shining, it's a lovely day. A perfect morning for a kid to play. But you've got lots of bills to pay. Besides this one, what favorite stage show and why? And personally, I've always uh, shared a great affinity uh, for the, the, the musical The Drowsy Chaperone. I don't know if you've heard of it, Nikki. No. Bear, a pop opera. Well, there's this character, the man in chair. Uh, I've just always seen a lot of myself in him. I, I don't know why. Well, I'll never forget when I was eight and my parents took me to see Les Mis. It, uh, it had a deep impact on me, uh, like many people of my generation. Did they make a musical of Showgirls? You remember that, I br Oh, you had a little bit too much drink that night. <laughs> well, I don't follow a lot of musical theater. Oh, oh, I did go to one community theater performance that Rod was in. Uh, he drug me oh, to it. Oh, oh, it was uh, Man of La Mancha. <sighs> he played Don Quixote. I've never seen another stage show. I thought he was quite good because uh, it, he was this guy who was pretending all these things that weren't really real, but uh, it was very, uh, it was very good. You, I like that one. You thought I was good? Yeah. Oh, Nikki, that's... Oh, I'm just turning red! <laughs> yeah. I just... I couldn't help but uh, really grasp the message of you can be a convict, you can be a, a wronged man, you can have this horrible life, all these horrible things happen to you, and you can still rise to the top and, uh, you know, win the French Revolution, you know, or whatever it's about. Who's funniest person on Avenue Q and why? Well, I guess Brian... Brian... He's a, a stand-up comic or, or something, right? But of course, you know, like many stand-up comics, uh, well, uh, never mind. <laughs> Not many people can pull off a Hawaiian shirt every day of the week. Oh, that's true. I never thought about that. Okay, I like <laughs> Brian too. Brian's funny. Ish. That's a tough one. That's true. For me, it's a toss-up between Brian and, hmm, probably Gary Coleman. He's a professional. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> Why the f*** would I care? Christmas Eve, <laughs> because Asian people tend to be very blunt. But don't tell her I said that, because that would be racist. And you live on Avenue Q. You live on Avenue Q. You live on Avenue Q.